During this time, things took an emotional turn crew and black after co-star in Chicago. For Brumfield Open he opened up about his sadness and suicide ideas. The Chicago rapper has uploaded multiple Instagram posts about despair and suicide in recent weeks, which have received a lot of attention. Might have assumed were just advertisements for his new track, but they were actually allusions to his own troubles. On Wednesday's Tearjerker episode, Brumfield disclosed that he has been suffering from depression for a long time and has had suicidal thoughts. He told his lifelong friend, Jermaine Walker, that he believed he would be better off dead. As Walker tries to console Brumfield, magazine owner Ryan Henry enters and requests to meet with his friend alone. Henry, who was deeply saddened and upset, hugged Bromfield and told him, This may be difficult, but you don't have to do it alone. I love you, and you're valuable. Bromfield is like a little brother to Henry, and he will never abandon him. I know for better and longer than a lot of others, he said. That's around us, so this isn't our first conversation, and we haven't gone through this before. Said Henry if you tell me that you wants the potential just check out that I need nothing I'm just going to let happen. Van Johnson interjects and tells Bromfield for everyone got your back Bromfield responded by telling Johnson and Walker that his goal for the day was to drown himself in the pool. Johnson, crushed by his friend's comments, refused to leave his side and stepped on the bed walker of Brumfield. Brumfield was also advised to seek professional help with the tattoo. The artist stated that all he wanted to do was sleep on it. Brumfield sneaked out of the house the next day of filming. Missing according to the producers, the cast and crew of the show grew very anxious. They frantically searched for him, and Henry refused to film until he was able to gain access. Brumfield bed Johnson and Brumfield bed Johnson. Walker ultimately reached out to the rapper's brother, Don Brumfield, who confirmed the information. Four of the children have been diagnosed with depression. He also mentioned that mental illness runs in the family since they were children. Jasmine, one of his four sisters, committed suicide last year at the age of 24. When Four finally reached out to Johnson, he was advised to see him without any cameras on a different conversation. Producers Johnson informed producers that he and Four were on their way to Atlanta to visit Four's family.